Uniswap made an all-time high. What happens after we make an all-time high? We're gonna go over that in this video and of course see what's going on in the market. But before we do that, make sure you subscribe so you can stay up to date on the latest in the crypto space. So jumping right into it, look at Uniswap, breaking that all-time high, peaking up at $35, coming back down, holding the previously all-time high as support, guys. That is crucial that we're holding that. That is very good on the daily. But first, before we get into some more Uniswap news, let's check out what's going on in the crypto markets. As we see right here, Bitcoin hanging just below 51,000 bucks. Ethereum at 1,730 bucks, a hanging in there. But we know what all the what all the new people do. They come here, they go to coin like markcap.com, they click 24 hours, they see what's pumping. They're like, oh, I got I gotta get these, I gotta get these. They're all moving. Guys, please do not, do not go buy the things that are pumping. You're going to get yourself wrecked. You're gonna get wrecked. Look, Chiles is up 35%. 228% the last week. Why would you want to buy something that's up 228% last week? Probably not a good buy. Same thing with engine. Same thing with all these stuff, guys. All this stuff right here. And Uniswap is somewhere around here. Uniswap is up 9%. Or it just changed to 4% for the last 24 hours. And 39% for the week. It's doing very, very well. It's making all-time high. And of course, in this video, we're going to go over, if you don't already know, what happens when a coin makes all-time high. What, what does it do next? So stay tuned for that. But look, the whole point of me like bringing this up is so you guys stop buying the things that are pumping. Do not buy, do not go from the one thing that pumped a lot to the next thing that pumped a lot. You wanna look what's not pumping. So you click 24 hours twice, you get what's down. Look, ZK swaps down 10%, Ocean Protocol down 7%. It's still up 56% in the last seven days, but it's down a little bit today. Look at Voyager token, it's down 14% the last seven days and 5% in the last 24 hours. Ooh, maybe a good buy. Look at Phantom, down 30% in the last seven days and down 3% today. May possibly be a good buy. I'm not a financial advisor. I'm not telling you guys what to buy, what not to buy. But all I'm just saying is you don't want to buy the green. You do not want to buy this green because you're going to get wrecked. Homie, you're going to get wrecked and we don't, we like to buy low, sell high. We do not like to get wrecked because that means you're losing money. The whole point of being in the crypto space is to make money, right? Hey, so that's what you gotta do. Look for things that are down and then go from there. But of course, moving on to the good old Uniswap. Currently, you know, up around 4% for the day, which is pretty cool. Only has a $17 billion mark cap. You're like, homie, you said only has $7 billion, $17 billion mark cap. We'll go compare that to good old Ethereum. Ethereum has a $198 billion mark cap. Tether has a $36 billion dollar market cap so if you if you if you swap would double it'd be right around number three on the coin market caps so hey let's see if that can happen but of course you go over and you use some uniswap say we we want to take one eth and go buy uh some uh, basic attention token you know you, like you go and do this the fees are crazy the fees are ridiculous you go and do this you're probably, you're probably gonna end up spending at least 50 to 100 bucks on fees it's kind of crazy right now so you know when are they gonna fix this Uniswap problem with, like, with fees, because the fees is with Ethereum, it's not with Uniswap. But version three, there is a lot of uh, you know speculation what will come out from version three, possibly having limit orders on this right here. Having a limit order would be pretty cool, because as of right now, you see you connect your wallet up here, you can change from light to dark, blah, 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 you know, all, like all that good stuff. But like if they could have a limit order, just like with Pro Coinbase, you know, just like with Binance, that would be pretty cool. Because right, like as of right now, you have to physically put the order into buy or sell whenever you want to buy or sell. Sometimes it's not always possible. Say if you're at work or you're just you're just like out like out and about, you can't really do that. So that would be cool. Another thing is somehow making the fees a lot less like when you buy or sell. So you know, Ethereum, we all know Ethereum is very very expensive right now, extremely expensive. If you're gonna go minute and like nft you're going to go buy an nft it's going to cost like a lot of bucks but uniswap is trying to work on something to lower those fees when you buy on you know the, the uniswap decks so that right there is something else that would be very cool to do and if uniswap can actually do that if they can actually make this happen i really do believe we will see well over a hundred dollar uniswap not financial advice just to get on the internet but if they actually make that happen i think people are going to be using the, the uniswap decks a lot like that's going to be the number one decks most likely if they can reduce the fees, obviously, only time will tell. There's no guarantees, of course. But look, once we break all like all time high, we're we're gonna make all time high after all time high after all time high. That's just what's gonna happen, guys. We we've seen that before. Once we broke, we go back. Look, once we broke right here. Once we broke right there, guys. 
look what happened. It, it played around in, in that region for a little while. We played around there for a little bit. You know, we got some resistance, hold a support, resistance again, support. Bam, we held it, blast off. Literally, once we finally held that as support, we blasted off. And we, I mean, we've gone up way over 100, like 100%, just from this peak right here to like, just right there, 155%. Then we pull back just a little bit, not much at all. But look at us now, consolidation pump, Bitcoin's down as well. We consolidate as well. Healthy pullback. Bam, we're coming back up, making new time new all-time high. Literally going to the moon, guys. It's literally going right now. This is super, super good. Let's see what does the MACD have to say. The MACD, hey, it had that cross right there. Had that cross right there. That right there is very bullish, guys. We wanted to see that. Look, the histogram's going up. We want to see, we want to see some more upper mo like momentum on the histogram. Um, keep in mind though, it's a lagging indicator. Price action is king. And as of right now, we're still, we're making an all time high. Let's see this thing continue, continue to grow. That would be great. And the new updates coming for Uniswap. That's also another great thing to be checking out because who knows, like there is no exact date when it's coming out. I have not seen an exact date, but if they can add limit orders, if they can reduce the fees for Ethereum, that would be absolutely amazing. And Hey, maybe Ethereum will fix them before Uniswap gets to it. But, uh, the odds of that happening are, yeah, just crickets, guys. Just crickets. The odds are very unlikely. So just keep that in mind, guys. Hopefully, we we can see an update with uh, like Ethereum, Uniswap. But guys, are are like are you guys buying when things are pumping like this, or are you guys buying the things that are down? Especially you guys look like look at the seven days. Phantoms down a lot. Cardano's down a lot. And I mean, just like get the things that are down. Buy low, sell high, guys. I hope this helps you realize, hey, buy low, sell high. Uniswap is doing good, and I expect it to do good in this bull market. But keep in mind, though, right now it's up. Right now it's up, and I personally would not be buying right now. But as always, let me know what you're buying down below. And I hope you guys like this video. Smash that like button. Subscribe for more content. And I'll catch you guys all in the next one. Until then, peace out.